What's going on guys, it's Red Dog. This is the new map decommission. I thought I'd give you like a map tour so you can check out the layout of the map, all the surrounding areas. And then there's a, a section in the middle I wanted to focus on because it's particularly interesting to me. So yeah, I'm just gonna be running around, checking things out. Like all these abandoned ships and there's like a, some unique like things. I just like to see the surrounding areas and check out all the the detail of the new maps when I get them. Maybe you guys don't have the paid elite service and you haven't haven't seen these. As far as playing this map, it's pretty good. It's a medium sized map. Um, you can run around the perimeter and get around people pretty easily. I haven't played Domination on it yet, so I don't know what that's going to be like. But uh, yeah, kill confirm TDM. You know, it's pretty good. You don't get too many camping spots. There's a couple little head glitch areas and a couple ladders you can go up to perch over a little bit. And nobody seems to rush the middle too often, unless you kind of hold up over there in this building, uh, over here in the middle. But uh, other than that, it was it was fun. It was more fun than the other one. Um, I might do a map tour of that next. It's called Offshore, I think. It's like a big oil rig in the ocean. It's not particularly interesting, but as I'm running around, you'll see me looking at. There's like a bunch of unique signs and and uh, there's always cool little things they put in the maps if you take the time to notice the detail on them. Anyways, I keep running around. I'm going to finish my loop around the map to where I started. Here you go. Do not pee here. It's weird. I don't get it. Apparently that's not a spot you want to urinate at, but uh, about to finish the loop. Tigers? We have tigers on this weird little... It's like a shoreline village, I guess. But anyway, this is the point of the map that I wanted to focus on, really, and it's this disgusting butcher shop. Like they put a little too much detail into this thing for my taste. Dead pig, guts, ugh. I don't like it. Look at this one. His guts are actually hanging out. What's up, buddy? How are you? Yep. You're already dead. Drink it on the job. Another pig head. You can't interact with them. You can shoot them, but then they, they take bullet damage like metal. It's weird. Um, a bunch of assorted pig parts. That's gross. That's gross. Um, this looks like straight out of a horror movie with the flickering lights. More dead pigs. Uh, he's really dead. He's got his guts in his mouth. Pig head. But yeah, anyway, I thought they went into a little too much detail on this part of the map. They could have just made this uh, a butcher shop. They didn't have to put flies in here. Let's see if he blows up. Nope. Anyway, I was just thoroughly disgusted by this place. I'll probably never go in there again. Oh, hey, here. Buy some meat. Disgusting chickens. I'll murder some chickens real quick. No big deal. Always fun to murder chickens, but Anyway, that about sums up this map. I did a quick loop. I let you see some of the detail and this butcher shop is particularly disgusting So I thought I would point it out Anyway, not much else to see Actually, I'm gonna go over here real quick to the shoreline scope in see if I can see a little more more detail on these the surrounding area that's something I always like to look at at the map. It's like they don't have to necessarily put stuff out there, but seems to to add to the flavor, you know. I always have a problem as far as map design on some of the maps, but at least there's some cool things you can check out while you're running around and getting side busted by campers. Well, thanks again for watching, guys. Take it easy, and I'll catch you on the next video.